February 26, 1993, the first World Trade Center bombing. A stolen car was involved with that. It was detonated underneath the, one of the World Trade Center towers. Six people died. The FBI, with their evidence response team, was able to pull out this mangled piece of chassis from the wreckage. And they said, you know what, that's probably where the bomb originated from. What they did is they found a VIN number that was on that chassis and they traced it back to a Ryder truck dealership in Jersey City, New Jersey. The terrorist rented that van in order to load it with bombs and detonate it underneath one of the World Trade Center buildings. Now that guy, the terrorist, ended up reporting that van stolen in order to try and alibi himself out to try and separate himself from that car. That guy even went back and tried to get his $400 security deposit back. Luckily, the, the agents at the, uh, at the rider truck, they pushed him back a couple days. The FBI was able to grab onto that guy and eventually they found enough cyanide in a storage container that would have taken out a whole town. Think about that, vehicle crimes. If somebody would have found that van one day earlier, that explosion may never have happened. In the end, six out of the seven terrorists were caught and they're all serving life sentences in prison.